they got it. Pocket dragons, they're brave as they can be. They're small, but what you get isn't always what you see. Something new around every corner, like you found the mystery. Pocket dragon adventure. Take it you don't remember. No, I don't think so, but well, look it up on YouTube if you're with a computer in your home. house. Okay then. I loved it. Right? There were dragons and like really little on the thing, so it's wizard's pocket. Okay, that's enough of that. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah. There we are. Good chills. If you remember any more, put them on Facebook. Do you remember Williams Wash Wellington? <gasps> Yeah, I do. Do you really? Because yeah, I say that to people and no one, no one ever remembers it. It's like, and I sing it, they're like, no, what the guy, are you on about? The guy, with the, big, <laughs> the guy with the big blonde hair. Yeah. And he was like really munchkin-y. He, he had magic big, whalies. Yeah and, the, yeah, and he made a wish in them. Like, for example, he didn't want to tidy his room, so he's like, I wish uh, this room would tidy itself. And then it tidied <laughs> itself. And then all his, and it would always go wrong. <laughs> oh, he wished it wrong. <laughs> his wish would always go wrong, though. For Willie. Like, he wished, once he wished that the whole world was made of candy. Candy. Yeah, it was sweets. <laughs> Actually, no, it's British, isn't it? Sweets. And then he ate so much he got fat. So, yeah. So they always go wrong. Yes. yes. I don't actually remember any of the storyline. Well, I just I, remember them. I do. I really do. Good. I that's really do. Lovely. Oh, wow, that's been such a good memory roller coaster. Anyway, we've got, <laughs> soon coming up, we've got um, requests from David McFadge and Campbell and Louis Pui and Gareth Scott. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and Gareth's got that. And we've also got Abby Young's request as well. So, yeah. We've got lots of requests coming up. Uh, 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 did you hear? Apparently. Actually, no, I don't, no I'm not going to say that. Okay, let's go for another song, shall we? No. What were you going to say? I was going to say that, but I think well, that might be private. Yeah. About Garmit? How is that private? No, you know how she's. <laughs> go away! <laughs> Anyway, yeah. Oh, um, we've got. Oh, did you know that some people that I know know Gamu from X Factor? Yeah, I know them too. You know. <laughs> oh yeah, you know too. No, well, yeah, they do. <laughs> they know Gamu. Gamu. Annie says she remembers those days with the kids' TV shows. Yeah, my mum used to um, watch them with me too. Yeah, and Naomi texted me and said, "Tell Tom I watch Pocket Dragons." <gasps> Naomi! No, it's Nay. Nay! <laughs> See, I told you! I was listening back to last week's one, you're like, Nay! Love you, love you, Nay! <laughs> so funny! <laughs> Feel this! <laughs> <laughs> it's a mouse pad. It's so squishy! <laughs> <laughs> Let's play a tune. Let's, right, um, here's um, Pink's new. Um, Tom, smell this. <laughs> Shut it. Here's Pink's new um, single. Pink. She's been gone a while and she's come back with a new album. She's got a greatest hits album coming out. I don't really like Pink, but hey. This song has swears in it, but since we're not allowed to play swears, and I don't really like swears, I dubbed the swears and Jason Magoo kindly replaced the swears with a word, melon. I can't wait. Melon. So yeah, here you go. Here's Raise Your Glass. Is that how you say glass, or is that too English? Glass. Glass. <laughs> glass, yes, everyone in Campbelltown says it. Here's Raise Your gla Glass. Glass. <laughs> By Pink. So, um... Yeah, so basically, yeah, yeah. So basically, yeah, that's basically. Yeah. Um, basically, I yeah. needed a pee. Didn't know where to go, so... What are you on about? <laughs> <laughs> Here's Raise Your Glass by Pink. Pink. We have a YouTube account where you can listen to any episodes that you've missed. It's a bit like having our own BBC iPlayer, but unlike the BBC, we don't remove the videos after a week. I love when it's all too much. 5 a.m. Turn the radio up. Where's the rock and roll? You guess who is a mystery? Can you guess who? I like guessing who on a Friday. Can you guess who? Do you have a clue? Guess who? Guess who? Guess who? Well, it wasn't supposed to be Guess Who Now, but I might as well just do it since so we played the wrong thing. <laughs> yeah, okay, sure. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, Abby Young, your um, song's coming in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> minute. <laughs> After right, let's who. play Guess Who. I love Guess yeah, Who. Yeah, Guess Who. Right, um, let me see. Where's my clues? Oh, here they are. Right, Susanna. Yeah, hello. Do you want to hear the voice? I do. Okay, here we go. Now I can buy a big fat peep bum and I've got the answer to... 
<laughs> what does it say? <laughs> no. Buy a big fat what? <laughs> Pete bum. <laughs> Pete bum. Yeah, and it was going to say, I cut it off when it says, and now I know the answer too, and I cut it off because it gives away the answer. Okay. Right, so do you want to hear it one more time and then we'll start with clues. Okay. Now I can buy a big fat peep bum and I've got the answer to... <laughs> Sounds like he's saying, now I can buy a big fat pig bum. I don't actually yeah, know. Yeah, it's really what I don't, I, <laughs> I don't really know what he's actually saying. Okay, okay. Okay, have a clue. okay number one. This person is quite attached to kids in a kind of a weird, freaky way. <laughs> um, Madonna? <laughs> what? Because <laughs> she, like, adopts them. No. Next clue. All time. This is a male. It's different because we usually have women. We had women the last two weeks. Oh, right. This is a male this time. Um, um, do they, like, work with kids? Kind of. Okay, I don't know the next question. I mean, clue. Right, here's it, here's it again. Now I can buy a big fat peep bun, and I've got the answer to... Oh, is he like, um, is he, is that like a puppet and he's speaking to the kids? Um... It sounds like that. Well, it's, a uh, not human. Mr. Bobby. He doesn't speak, he goes, Bobby, 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 Bobby! Oh, I can't remember. Okay. Okay, next one. Next clue. This person drives around in a van. Mr. Bean? Oh, no, wait, what about <laughs> yeah, it's a little green car. <laughs> <laughs> drives about in a van. Oh, that guy. Um, is he on a, he's on a kids' TV program, then, if that's the theme. Yeah. Ah, he does. The next clue might give yeah. up. Yeah. The next clue. Um, he's part of a trio. I don't know. Is that actually his voice like that? No, it's kind of changed. It, it's very it sounds similar. Like, very think, similar, but it is changed. I recognise it, but I can't think. Right, well, go in the next number one. six. One of them's green, one of them's purple, and one of them's pink. Is it someone from the Who? Yeah! Is it Ivor? No. I can't remember the other guy's name. The other one's the easiest one to, to remember his name. It's the least... Now I can buy a big fat peep bun, and I've got the answer to... Well, do you know which colour which color one it is? Purple. No. Ivor's green, though, isn't no. it? No. I really... Ivor's I, purple. I can't remember. It's... Groove. Groove. Ivor, oh. Groove and Tula, or something. I don't really know oh. the names. No, yeah, okay. That's Let's see if good anyone's guessing. guessed it already. Nope. No one on Facebook. No one watched the hoop. <laughs> no. I honestly, I didn't watch them when I was young. I actually just used to get, like, not, like, six. I actually did watch it when I was, like, ten. It wasn't on when you were six anyway. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no, I did the same thing, so I can't yeah. exactly make fun of you. Anyway, so, yeah, let's now play Abby Young's song. Well, um, she wanted Proud Mary by Tia and Turner, but um, since she likes Glee, she goes to Glee Club as well. Thought we'd play the Glee version. Yeah. But then when we told her, she was like, oh, oh okay then. Wait, uh, can we just play the That song? I have to do. Yeah. So, um, yeah, and then we'll play the number one at the moment. Well, actually, I'm not sure. We're not, we're not counting the midweek chart. This is from last, like, Sunday. Yeah. Number one, because we don't like the midweek chart. In our days, there was no midweek chart. There was Top of the Pops. And Pingu. And Pingu. <laughs> so yeah, here's Guess Who theme tune, and then we'll go straight into whatever. Why are you playing the Guess Who theme tune? Because we didn't end it. We always end up with Guess Who theme tune. Oh, sorry. Is it me? Is it you? Who knows? Can you guess who is a mystery? Can you guess who? I like guessing who on a Friday. Can you guess who? Do you have a clue? Guess who? Guess who? Guess who? Who? Bacious. <laughs> <laughs> That's a hoop. Now I can no. buy a big fat peep bun and I've got the answer to hoop news. That's another hoop. A big fat peep bun with jam and icing oh, and a cherry. Oh, they're so cool. Hoopy bits box. <laughs> <laughs> what was the blue guy called that was like their... Hubba Hubba. Oh yeah. Hubba. He came up on the TV and told them where they had to go. Sorry, Abby. Ooby-galooby. 
When's it coming on? Why are you <laughs> not happy? Here's Abby's song. Who? Who be boo No. Okay, here's Abby's song. Sorry. Let's go back, shall we? She's in South End. You probably can't even hear it anyway. Oh, yeah. So what's even the point? Um, oh, I know why. It's Abby's coming on later. She's doing the quiz. Yeah, Abby, yeah. We were going to try and get Mr. McVicker, but then um, Abby was like, I'll do it! So yeah, so said, we got okay. her instead. Anyway, here we go. Sorry, Abby. Here's your song. Went away, but he's back. Yeah, that was um, Glee uh, with Proud Mary, Mr. Crossan's favourite programme. And Mr. Cross's dog's here! Oh, Poppy. Poppy. Wait, and written in the stars, <gasps> but time temper. Anyway, okay, so yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Excuse me, just speaking dog. over me. Hi! Doggy! Right, okay. Are you not going to put your headphones oh, on? Oh, ooh, my headphones. Right. Have you not noticed? Have you, like, I had that weird feeling where this didn't feel real. Has anyone ever ha had that feeling when you just feel the. You on autopilot. You said that to me once and I wasn't sure if I had it. It's like on autopilot. It's, I, I feel as if my body's just an autopilot. I'm not actually thinking about what I'm saying. So weird. Mm. Maybe it's a sign of getting old. What do you think, Mr. Cross? Oh, yeah, I'll turn your mic on. Right, great. Explanation. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> Um, I'm quite interested about these hoob things that we've got going on here, because I forgot that I had these on here. Let's go back. What do you think, Susanna? Mm. <laughs> Bacious! <laughs> they always have weird noises, these hoobs. What's um, It's like a kid's program it used to be on at 6 in the morning on the channel, on channel 4. Now I can buy a big fat peep bun and... Oh. I've got the answer to Hoob News. Do a do a YouTube search from Mr. Pastry. Mr. Pastry. Was that back oh. in your day? That was back in the day. Back in the forties. Right, if there's any oldies listening, <laughs> oldies. Have I? Have I? <laughs> I feel as if I'm echoing at the moment. Am I echoing? Um, yeah, a little bit. It's probably just. It's because it's coming off all the other microphones. Uh, yeah. Clever. The 3D effect. 3D effect. Mm, la, la, la. You see, you've got all this 3D television there. Here you are, 3D radio. That's a first. 
It is a first. Mm. Right, Mr. Pace.